This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. There we go. Absolutely right. So the main event on that show, by the way, was Christian beating Christopher Daniels uh, with Joe and Tomko at ringside. And the show ends with you and Joe arguing. It kind of feels at this point, I got to say it, we've said it already. It's a, a three-way feud with you, Joe, and Christian. Uh, are, are, are you having thoughts now? Like, hey, if you needed to keep Joe with me, just let me work with Joe then. Or, hey, I'm fine. Just let me work with Christian. Is it one or the other? Or, or are you just, hey, I'm the company oh. man, whatever you need me to do? What I wanted to do is I wanted to finish my program with Joe, have the program with Christian for the world title, and then go back to Joe. But for some reason, they attached Joe to me, and they continued to keep yeah. him to me. And I thought that made it a lot more complicated. I think Joe could have went off, wrestled somebody else, got over, got some wins under his belt, and came back and wrestled for the NWA World Heavyweight title against me. But that's not what happened. and It's unfortunate. Could've yeah, I, I love that. Better. Yeah, let let it breathe a little bit. Let you two separate and do your own things and build you both back up for another another big event. So. Definitely. Well, you're announced for a New Japan show on February the 18th around this time frame. This is not the New Japan of the last five years with Okada on top and big business, uh, you know, as, as far as how it was then. They're losing money. They're in the red. How does this deal come to be? Is it through TNA? Is it a separate deal? Do you remember how that all came together with you and New Japan at the time? That deal came together because of Brock Lesnar. What happened was Brock was the champion over there for New Japan Pro Wrestling. And he wouldn't do a job for any of the wrestlers over there. And he told the, the head of the promotion uh, to get a hold of Kurt Angle and have Kurt Angle come over here and beat me for the world title, and then he'll drop it. And so that's how New Japan ended up contacting me was because of Brock Lesnar. <laughs> Wow. Okay. And Dixie and TNA, everybody was fine with that, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. And, and Dixie, you know, after a while, TNA started booking me over there. And what they did is they decided um, I was supposed to give TNA a certain amount of dates that I was getting paid for. They started including those dates in New Japan and even uh, dates with AAA. So I wasn't getting paid for those dates. TNA was. Uh, but but I was getting paid a good sum of money. I was right. really happy with that. But I was just surprised that they included these dates with the TNA dates. And then eventually I went to Dixie and I said, listen, I can't go over there anymore. I Like I went over there six times in two years. I went to AAA a couple of times and it was a lot of travel and it was getting really hard on me. I was wrestling full time for TNA and also doing New Japan and AAA. And I told Dixie, I can't do this anymore. I can only wrestle for uh, TNA. And uh, she obliged and said, don't worry, uh, th that's where we'll go. Well, there's talk of you going to AAA, which you had just mentioned, uh, to work a major show along with New Japan. And uh, you were just mentioning it a little bit ago. I guess you didn't have to clear those bookings with TNA. They were partnering together with TNA. Um, is Who's handling all this for you? Is this Dixie and her team, and they're just telling you where to be and where you got to go and all that kind of thing? Yeah, pretty much Dixie and TNA. Um they were taking the bookings from New Japan and AAA, and they were having me go over there. Like I said before, I wasn't getting paid for it. It was part of my contract or part of my dates in TNA. At least TNA made it that way. And, uh, you know, eventually I put a stop to it because it was getting to be too much, too much traveling, too much working, uh, not just for one company, but for three companies. And I felt like I just wanted to focus on TNA. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.